Hi guys, I thought I would just do another little Harry Potter haul video for you. Uh, just a couple of items that I've recently bought myself. Um, the first I am very excited about, I've just undone it um, just so that I didn't have to do it on camera. Uh, this is the Wizarding World pre-release Patronus Pop. Um, I got it from the platform nine and three quarters shop in the UK. Um, it is a bit delayed, but I'm kind of glad about that because the earlier ones that got sent seemed to just be in a plastic bag and they were all arriving broken and damaged. And for people who keep them in their boxes, um, it wasn't a very good situation. So they must have heard the outcry of Funko Pop fans and they're now actually popping them in boxes, which is really nice. So it just says the Harry Potter shop at platform nine and three quarters. Um, this is the first time I've actually opened it, so we'll see what's inside together. It looks as if they've actually wrapped it up as well. Oh, yeah. So, very excited about this one. It's taped up as well. Bear with me one second. There we go. Just ripped the tape. Nope, it still doesn't want to come off. Oh, it's there. So yeah, has anyone bought this uh, pre-release Patronus Pop? It seemed to sell out really quickly, in the UK at least. And there he is. So Harry Potter's Patronus, the stag. I do like the fact that they've done them in light blue, though I really wish that they would glow in the dark, because I don't think they are, which is annoying. But I'm so glad he's arrived safe. So yeah, that's the first one. And then... I never b managed to get myself um, one from the la last wave. So one with the sorting hat. I think it was a Barnes & Noble exclusive in the US and then it didn't seem to come to the UK really. So I've just managed to buy this one on eBay. So very happy about that. One can now go with Hermione and Harry. And then in Smiths, I've started on the next wave. <laughs> so many to catch up on. Uh, so Padma Patel or Patil. She was actually um, only £5 so I bought her last week so if any of you are looking for this latest wave uh, do check Smith's toy stores because a lot of them are now £7 and they reduce quite a few to 5 And then I also bought Ginny. I am one of those people who keep the majority of them in boxes, so I do like to make sure that my boxes are as pristine as I can get them. <laughs> so this next item um, I managed to find on Amazon. I think a lot of people did as well. It's the Funkoverse strategy game. Um, but uh, two or three weeks ago, they actually had it for £12, which is an absolute steal. So I had to pick this one up. Not quite sure exactly how you play it, but I figured it will be quite nice for Christmas. Um, get my family interested in Funko Pops at least, and these, because um, I've already got the bigger versions on them. Um, I don't mind people handling. So yeah, if anyone has actually played this and knows how to play it, please do leave a comment. The next items I got were also from Amazon, and these are the... Is it lenticular notebooks? So you've got um, Lucy's Malfoy, Constant vi Vigilance, can't say it, Death Eaters or Monsters, and then it goes towards the um, profit front page, dark times ahead, be vigilant. So it's uh, two headlines from the paper and they're just um, normal notebooks. So that was the first one. Oh, and they both got the dot mark on the back. And then this next one, um, it says dot times ahead. 
again I think the other one does as well and then see if I can get it at the right angle there we go Bellatrix Lestrange wanted she wasn't captured whereas Lucius was captured at the ministry so yeah I definitely had to get these when I saw them so they were from Amazon I think they're classed as an add-on item so you can't get them by themselves you need to buy something and then add them on um these were my black friday deal i picked up some pajamas these were from sainsbury's in the uk and i'm a big lover of snape so i had to get the potion class School of Witchcraft and Wizardry um, PJs. Really nice and soft. Um, they are long sleeved for winter, which I like. So yeah, couldn't resist. Got a nice flack in them. So you got the Apologies Potion. I can't say it. Amortentia, I can't say them right now. And uh, Liquid Look, there we go. <laughs> And then the trousers. Have cauldron, shooting stars. Not quite sure what that diagram is. Potions class. Got the potions. But yeah, I couldn't resist these. Um, I think they were down to twelve fifty instead of sixteen. So yeah, a good deal. A good deal. So, um, yeah, they were just my little purchases that I thought I would show you, especially the Funko Pop, because I know a lot of people wanted it and it sold out really, really quickly. But it is a pre-release exclusive, which means it will be a common pop. Probably, if not the next wave, the wave after that. But yeah, I hope everyone has a nice Christmas. It is coming up to it. So, um, happy holidays and thanks for watching.